all right guys comet k is around the corner and i know many of you are feeling the pressure but don't worry today we are going to discuss last minute strategies which will help you to crack the exam and i know some of you are probably thinking i have wasted too much time what if i messed up the exam am i even ready so don't worry you are not alone ab kar loge and in today's video to help you guys i have invited someone who has been exactly where you are right now yes i am talking about dilraj who cracked comet k last year with air 466 in just last few days he is here to share his tips and strategies that worked for him in these last days also don't forget to watch this video till the end aadhi aduri video dekh ke jaoge to koi fayda nahi hoga so without wasting any more time let's start this video so dilraj with only 5 days left how did you structure your daily study schedule to make the most of it since i was preparing for jee mains my revision was spoiled was on a quite good level my main focus was the mock test getting through the questions which i made error i made a copy for all the errors i made during the mock test and analyzed those stuffs in the, during the last 5 days uh, for the physics i just went through all the important formulas of modern physics electric current chapter and uh, the ray optics uh, and those stuffs in chemistry i went through full chemistry revision marks i didn't focus that much only the main main topics like matrices determinants chemistry i go through a thorough revision of inorganic organic and all the organic formulas and just given mock test and nothing more that's great so moving on to our next question which topic in physics chemistry and mathematics did you focus in these last days although in comet k question comes from each and every chapter but in the last week my main focus in physics was modern physics ray optics current electricity and magnetism just going through all the important formulas and solving some questions and in the mock test papers in chemistry i focused mainly on organic reaction mechanisms coordinate compounds and a full ncert revision like every day read me two three chapters of ncert it's very important to read ncert in comet k all the question comes from the ncert in text questions In Max my main focus was matrices determinants calculus and probability probability plays a major role in comet k many questions comes from probability and you know calculus it's very big and and most of the easy questions comes from calculus although students are scared of calculus but as you solve the max questions calculus is the most easy thing it comes in comet k so moving on to our next question what was your revision strategy for both class 11th and 12th how did you cover so much in less time for revising class 11th and 12th i mostly used my short notes which i prepared during my jee mains preparation I mostly focused on class 12th as most of the questions in comet k comes from class 12th my main revision was through the mock test and the mock questions which i solved during the comet k preparation or in the last week of comet k so before moving ahead i would like to tell you ki aap jo bhi college choose karoge na uska curriculum zarur dekhna because it's very important to learn skills jinki future mein demand achhi hone wali hai so i would like to tell you about vedam school of technology vedam ka advanced tech curriculum is designed by ex professionals of google and microsoft it is made specially for students who want to pursue career in computer science artificial intelligence robotics cyber security and blockchain so to get admission here you have to give Vsat Vedam's Holistic Aptitude Test, which is national level online exam, going to happen on 12th of May, and the last date of registration is 11th of May. And you can also give it at home online. So basically, Vedam School of Technology offers four years on-campus computer science and AI program, which will get you a B.Tech degree from Ajinkya D. Y. Patil University, se milegi, which is UGC approved university. You will get AI powered labs and immersive coding ecosystem, which will help students to improve. Improve their coding skill. You will also get free MacBooks, and if you are interested in startup, you will get funding up to one crore rupees. Also, Vedam provides free scholarship program. First, merit based scholarship up to hundred percent. Second, women in tech scholarship up to twenty percent, and the third one, need based scholarship up to thirty percent. So, if you are interested in CS and AI, you can definitely apply for VSAT. Link in the description. So, moving on to our next question, which study material, books, or online resources help you the most in the last few days? For Comet K, I didn't use any external study material. I only had my coaching modules, my notes, and the NCERT. But the most thing which helped was the NCERT. Going through NCERT line by line is the most important thing, which 90% of the students don't do. NCERT helps to solve the theory questions which come in Comet K. Your 
hand written notes which you made during the coaching help you to go through the questions which have some tricks involved in it during comet k the main book or the resource for your student focus should be ncrt now let's talk about most common question how did you attempt your mock test in these last days i gave around 4 to 5 mock tests in the last week of comet k during the comet k examination timings like 12 to 3 or 9 to 12 after giving the test my main focus was to go through all the questions which i did wrong or which i didn't attempt i made a copy like a rough copy or a error copy which uh, in which i wrote all the questions and the concept which i didn't know or i made some errors and then at night or before sleep i revised those concepts so that i won't make the same error in the next mock test it helped me to improve my marks like uh, first i was scoring around 80 to 90 and then at last when i gave my final mock test my score was around 142 and that was the last mock test and then i gave my comet good sir so moving on to our next question dilraj how you manage time in the exam because time management is very important in the exam yes time management is one of the most important things to be focused in comet k but i didn't have any specific time allotment for each subject like 70 to chemistry 40 to physics 80 to maths my main focus was to solve each and every question which came in front of me i started with chemistry because i know i am comfortable with chemistry and i can solve the most out of it then i went to physics and then maths i gave very less time to maths because in my shift the questions were lengthy it took me around 1 to 2 minutes to solve each and every question whereas in chemistry it took me 10 to 30 seconds to solve each and every question maths mostly i focus on short tricks like uh, putting n to 0 or 1 or some random elimination methods chemistry i solved with method mind because i know i would make many mistakes in chemistry and to reduce that i would give it the most time and most focus that's great so dilraj tell me how you approach a difficult or unfamiliar question in examination when i encounter a difficult or an unfamiliar question i just simply put a random option to it if i found it somewhat like i have solved it before i would mark it for review or else i would just put a random option because i know i have to solve 180 questions in 180 minutes there is a very less chance that i can come back to the question again with a fresh mind moving on to our last question what final advice would you like to give students who are aiming to score 140 plus in comet k this year especially the ones who are feeling under prepared my final advice to the comet k students would be to focus more on the subject with which they are comfortable give as many mock tests as you can with analysis start reading ncrt if you haven't as most of the one liners question comet k comes from ncrt have a healthy diet as it is very important before any competitive exams and trust the process so that's it guys for this video i know some of you might still feel unprepared you might be thinking about giving up taking a drop about how others are ahead of you sirf exams dete ja rahe ho aur koi exam mein acha score nahi aa raha hai vit ho gaya jee ho gaya comet ke aur bit set bacha hai but i want to say you still have time you can change the game if you don't waste time watching other strategy videos on youtube and if you are watching this video till now then comment mein likh do bhaiya i promise i will work hard i will get to know how many of you are serious about these exams so yeah guys video ko yahi conclude karte hain jaakar padhai karo abhi aur milte hain next video mein tab tak ke liye bye bye